All right. Actually, no, we can do the next two because I have replays for both of them. Cause, oh, really? Yeah, because this is a shortcut for the Bubble Cove from his original demo, and I actually beat it. I was one of, I think, three people who beat it? Three or four? It was like me, me, me Eco, Nepster, and Josh, I think, all beat it. So? It seems like a rather small amount of skills. I've remembered that caught my eye. Yeah, Sablon's demo here. Yeah. Provided he didn't backroot seal it. So you put a blocker at the beginning. Ooh, yeah, it's about time we heard this song. So then we're going to let a climber climb up over that. I don't know what song's playing. I'm just listening to Ballad of oh. Burning Squirrel instead. That's, that's cool. So then we're going to send the other climber up, have this guy build. He'll keep going. This is basically like a giant miner level. Hmm. I'm trying to figure out why that staircase was there. Oh, Yeah, okay. we're mining through the giant Okay. Water. That basher is also super precise. Then we platform over, Go the, over exit. the exit. Yep. And mine down through the whole mess and yeah. dash to the end, and that's it. Yep, and that, thankfully and that yep, steel, the steel block is there at the end so that you can go underneath the blocker as well. And once again, bomber on a 100% level. Flopsy's gonna be mad when he reaches the Omega 2 level that requires you to use the bomber on a 100% save level. Oh, to drop an Ono or into an exit? Yep. The, the tricky bit is it's an Amida level, so he does like using bombers as red herrings in 100% levels. <laughs> and it's like, that's the one time you had to do it. And surprise, now you don't, because that's not clever, that's inconsistent. Right. Yeah, and then this is the one that I backrooted like two or three times on stream, and then he finally, <laughs> I got the intended solution. So, I think this is under stream levels. I will have to take a guess, though, as to which one it is. Yikes. <laughs> Rick play organization, friend. I know, I know. It'll probably be the most recent on something. And no. And one of these is probably going to be... Actually... Okay, I can't remember if this is the back re replay or if this is the real replay, so we're going to find out. <laughs> Nine climbers. Nine climbers. And seven dead. That's... That's something. Mm. This is looking like the back... Or the back root solution. <laughs> We're gonna find out. Because <laughs> I don't think that was there in the original. And I have no idea why I would make them swimmers anyways. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is looking like a solution that's now broken. Yep. <laughs> okay. Was that three or four? It was three, I believe. Alright. Alright. Maybe it's just under auto. Jiminy, you've got a lot of replays. Yeah, I do. No? Maybe not. Oh, great. Oh, this is bad. I don't actually remember how to do this level. I hope I have my replay still. <laughs> don't remember how to do it? <laughs> no, like I don't! Really to figure it out. <laughs> and it wasn't even in the demo. Oh, no. Nope. Okay. All right. Well, <laughs> I saw play it like a flute in there. Yeah. Yeah, that, that was a pretty good level. I remember solving that one. Oh, thank you. A while back. So, if memory serves, you just need to 
put a lot of lemmings through the traps. I do remember you need to build, block, build, build, block, build. Hmm. So that both the blockers go at least. Yeah. yeah. And both the builders. I do remember that much. Also, because there's a time limit. Yeah. So one, two, I three. See. Yeah, so that way two of them are going to die. The other's going to make it Two are going to die in that trap, yeah. Yep. Squished. I do Squished. like that trap if you have walls right next to it. Otherwise, it's just like, oh, yeah, the it, crushers came out of nowhere. <laughs> it does look pretty good if it's, um, you know, actually mm -hmm. used appropriately instead of just floating in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> Definitely. Okay, so if memory serves, we need to have a swimmer go down, swim over that, bash through all of that, so that way they can walk up and then dig down to the exit. Or bomb. The fact that that whole lemming and staff, lemming sarcophagus and staff over there is just a decorative object is, yeah, I don't know. It seems like it's solid, but it's not. Yeah. Let me put another climber up with them. If memory serves, it's the time limit that's tight on this one. Oh, right, there is a time limit here. Yeah. <laughs> I also don't remember how to get these guys up. Or rather, down, so then they can go up. That's probably what you need the extra climbers for, because you'd need to set up the builder blocker things beforehand. Maybe. Because the crowd's. <laughs> I still think my best bet is going to be find the replay, because I know I still have it. I don't delete my replays ever. <laughs> Unfortunately, they're not very organized. No, they're not, because I just set it to automatically record them. I always save my replays manually and try to keep them organized. It's probably a better idea. I just hate having to input manually input them. Unless he changed the level ID, in which case I will I will never find it. Remind me to shuffle my level ID is just as a trolling thing. Okay, that wasn't it. <laughs> Had to check. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then I'm. Oh man. Settle in, peoples. We could be here a while. Yeah. Hmm. A hall. A hall. Oh. It, it was the oh, call ahead. of Kiyusu, not call of Kiyusu. Okay. This should be the right one. Okay, this is looking good so far. This is a promising start. Yeah, okay. <laughs> also, you got a nice little sneak peek at some of the Art Lens levels that I've made. Or at least their names. Yeah, yeah, I did see a couple names. I didn't pay it too much heed. That's cool. I'll probably cut it out of the video anyways. <laughs> no one wants to watch 10 minutes of Artie being like, uh, where's my replay? Uh, uh, where'd I put the file? <laughs> I tell my this mom very... if she organized her files, this wouldn't happen. This is very slow. Click that fast. Oh, oh. So that's three of them. Past Artie, why is the release rate still at one? There's only two minutes left. 
You can always press the fast forward key and see what happens. Okay, so he's digging down. Oh, that's right. Now uh -huh. you make the nice shortcut. Okay. And that's why the release rate's been kept down to keep him spaced. Forgot about that. That was clever. Now the magic happens. Now the build block things. Yeah, because all, all of those lemmings are going to walk past him. Now we got now we got the swimmers. Space them out with the drowning animation. Yeah. Meanwhile, that digger's still going all the way down. So that's a lot of crazy timing. Then they bash them out. Now I maxed out the release rate. So then they're going to fall down there, just barely hit the tip of that, which is just barely not splat height. Mm -hmm. They can climb up, fall down. One of them's going to bash for there, the other's going to blow up so they can all go to the exit. Yeah. Nice. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Pretty impressive trick, I must admit. And with only eight seconds left to spare. Yep. Okay, that's that one was a little silly. Whew. All right. Do we want to attempt a one last one that I haven't done yet? Sure. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Leave the others Leave alone. Leave the others alone. Oh, I've I took a look at this one. This one seems intriguing, but at the okay. same time, I have no idea what to do with it. Wouldn't it be funny if all five of those pickup skills were red herrings? I wouldn't put it past this level, honestly. Hmm. But then again, I don't see how you would do it with no climbers. So my first instinct would be pass for blocker at the bottom of there, but Flopsy flat out said, like, you need to stop doing that. <laughs> Got floaters that can go down there. Is that the only exit? No. Okay. <laughs> if that was the only exit, we would have a problem. Oh, yes. Big one. Unless we could turn Yeah, it. that seems like it's tailor-made for floaters. I don't think anybody apart from floaters is getting down there. Okay. Builder there. Least... Builder there. Yeah, this could work. Love the catchy music. <laughs> hmm. Now what? You've got ten dudes heading towards the five floater right? Floater area. That's true. Probably too many. Yeah. If I could hold the other guys back, what I'm basically gonna do is build there, stop them from splatting. Oh, I'm out of bashers. Oh shoot. Wait a second. What happened to all those diggers that I picked up? Oh, those are those climbers. are all climbers, friend. I thought those were diggers. I don't know why. What good are climbers going to do? Oh, they can climb up there. At least supposedly. So basically, I need to. The thing is, it... flow control. <laughs> this is basically flow control part two. Only one of the guys from the top hatch can get to the climber pickups. But if you do that, then that leaves at most four guys left on the top. And you end up sending a sixth man down to the bottom, which it would seem like you can't do. Hmm, that, that is true. I could use both builders to turn them around, though. So this is basically all a question of when to max out the release rate.
Oh, yes, this is gonna be almost perfect. Fire. Yes, fire is a bit of a problem. But I can fix that. Not with the setup, I don't think you can. <laughs> I, I will never understand blocker physics. Because weird stuff like that happens. He just went between the blocker fields. Now we got five lemmings down here. Guess who's going to be the floaters? You got six down there because you let the sixth guy through instead of turning him with the block builders like was your original oh, strat. Yeah, okay. Well, that's easy enough. Because the miner's going to stop anyways. Is he? We hope he is. He did! Nice! That looks like that's it, then. That was remarkably easy. Uh, you'll probably have to respace those floaters so you can get over the gap, but that's easy enough. Oh, I forgot about that. Oh, then we can't use the second builder. Oh, right! Because you need a builder for that gap. Hmm. Forgot about that. About well, that. rip that idea. See, this is the problem for timing levels like this and crowd control. You can't really predict that. You just have to try stuff. Yeah, but if I do that... Oh. Bunch of them are gonna walk forward. But if I increase the release rate to 99 too soon, then they're gonna walk out of his digger hole before he's finished. I do like my idea from the beginning of just let them all go to that exit. I'm going to try to get that to work. <laughs> Even I don't know. I think that steel drop might be way too high. I mean, it could. I need to build slightly above that one. Yeah. With a blocker, I, mean, I can turn them. It could. In fact, it might be the only way. Honestly, because I just don't see another way to make the whole left the left exit even be viable. Maybe that's the whole gimmick of the level, is that the left exit is just a lie. Not put it past the level. Oh, yeah. I was about to say, we could put a blocker there, but he would turn, and we need the blocker up there. Mm-hmm. Lava! Oh. If we make him a floater, if we make him a floater red, that's gonna slow him down by one frame. That's not enough. But we need one destructive skill left over to free the blocker. Mm-hmm. 
That is one pixel too thick. That is super annoying. Crazy idea. If only there was some way to spare the basher. Cause, uh, yeah, that is just splat item. I, th yep. I think. I guess I'll, I might as well test it. Yeah, even the digger. Everyone, everyone dies. even the digger dies. So we have to use a miner at the start. There's no way any of the lower lemmings can get to the pickups. They're too high off the ground. It just yep. can't be done. Yep. Because we def. Unless we use both of our builders. And then how are you going to get everybody to the top exit? In fact, I don't even think both builders will do it. <laughs> Probably not. No, it's still too high. Even both builders can't do it. Yeah, it's true. Hmm. Because I'm thinking we can. There's a tiny little bit of terrain right there. If we put a blocker on that and then destroy the terrain with like a miner or a basher, everyone will be able to walk up. I don't know. But that doesn't even work because we need to turn a guy around for the builder there. Ugh. And it's got the really cheerful, upbeat music too, which is. <laughs> A little inappropriate. <laughs> let's see, let's see. There's... Why did you put terrain at the bottom of that triangle? Because it's too lazy to cover it with steel? Why not just move the whole thing two pixels down? Because he wanted it to be higher? <laughs> Wait a second. I don't know. If I could get one of them to grab the pickups earlier, you're hoping you could do a little climber juggle thing? I bet that'll work. I was going to make a level that did this trick as well. That forces you to do the whole little thing where the climber yeah, fidgets around. Yeah, I would, I would the call the level do a flip. Turning. Ah. Nope. He's still or too fast. Or he could just bump. He's still too fast. The timing doesn't line up right. Yeah, timing has to be really precise to make that work. Mm. pretty much have to turn it to 99 if you want it if you want the uh, climbers to line up perfectly at the top but then they don't line up perfectly down here Yeah, that just lines up perfectly on the top, but not on the bottom, which is disappointing. <laughs> if 
only there's a way to turn that guy around. May oh, wait. If one guy goes down there with him... Well, no, because then we could do the builder because blocker, then, but then you can't save the But then the blocker. the blocker's just stuck. Yeah. Ugh. I'm trying to think of a way that it might be possible to have four go in the left exit and six in the right. Like, maybe combining your blocker strat over here to try to make it so that the one guy can Maybe, maybe. No, I did not want to open the replays. Another option is, if we dig in this pillar at the middle, could we build up into it? And then build out onto that? We can use this pillar to gain a little height for the builders. Really? Well, that's a problem. I really don't think lemmings should fall through gaps like that. I think they should move up instead of down. Like the next two? Yes. Personal hmm. preference, I've gotten used to it, honestly. Oh, uh, yeah, I know. I just, if you think about it from a realistic standpoint, it does not make sense. But lemmings is not a realistic game. That it is not. Ooh. Well, at least the level's properly placed. <laughs> yes, that is true. That is true. Yeah, and we definitely need the basher for this part. No two ways about it, we need the basher there. Which is a shame, because I was wondering, well, could we mine down here, bash through all of that, then... Do I climb back up? Yeah, like, would there be a way to, like, dig down from here, grab them all, then climb back up? Hmm. I don't think so. Also, the one-way down arrows there are kind of weird. Uh... That screams they were put in to seal a back route of some kind. Yeah, probably to prevent you from just bashing through the wall. <laughs> Oh, wait, wait a second, wait a second. Well, actually, that's fine. Because mm -hmm. we'd still need a way to turn those guys around. I feel like we can use our destructive skills to gain some height in here to allow them uh, lemons down here to get up there in two builders. I mean, maybe. We could do a magic box part two kind of thing, but Ugh. this is definitely a rapture level. All right, basher there seems right. Miner there seems right.
Oh, how about this? He builds up, guys can climb back up. And we just need to figure out a way to make sure they don't go up there. I'm sitting over here with the level open, brainstorming other strategies. Okay. <laughs> I think I might have come up with something that could work, but if it does work, then it's absolutely silly. See, I, I found a way to get the climbers back up after they fall down off the bar, but the problem yeah. is getting exactly five back up. Because right now I, I can only I'm get I'm trying one. to come up with a rat that ignores the climber pickups completely. Like, they might just be a warning. I don't think they're lying. Yeah, I can only get one facing to the left. I could get I could get all five, but then that requires using the blocker, which is now unfreeable. Oh, oh no! I've got it! I've got it! I've got the solution. If you want to see. Okay, I've I've got the little preview window opening. <laughs> I'm gonna see if my strat works too, because if it does, then this level might just have two separate solutions. Oh wait, never mind. My solution's broken. It can't work. Oh, that's sad. Oh, perfect. This is wonderful. So I've got them all pinned in. So now the question is going to be: Can I separate one lemming out? Oh, that's not good. Can I separate one lemming out at the end to be the builder? Oh, <laughs> oops. He forgot to use the digger to make it, you know, yeah, climbable. So the can get back up.
And because of the way that the floater chamber here is set up, it should be easy enough to send to like set. Yeah, set the. Yeah, set I, I the, get. I get. Set you. the last four in line early, and then just set the last guy late. That's probably why the guy. I hope so that's tiny. enough. Whew. Nice. Okay, that I feel like that's got to be intended because that used everything. Yeah, and, I think that's probably it. And we got five lemmings to each exit, so. Well done, Flopsy. Man, that was hard. And looks good. I think we should probably call that enough, call that for now, right? Definitely. Okay, it looks like our connection got lost, so he will not be here to say goodbye, but I am... I'm glad Nintendo Addict was able to do this uh, co-commentary video uh, with me. Thank you very much to him. If you want, check out his YouTube channel. He also plays occasional Lemmings packs, but he also does other stuff as well. Definitely check him out. Once again, thanks for watching. I'm Colorful Artie, and if you tune in next time, we'll be doing more Rapture levels, except I don't think it'll be me and Nintendo Addict. It might be me and someone else, though. We'll have to just wait and see about that. Have a great day, and God bless.